The devil's job is to show up and throw every possible distraction at you to make you forget. He, he wants the glasses off. Yes. Amen. Whenever I want to go out and do something bad, have a drink, anything, it seems like the devil just paves the way. There's no interference. I got people calling me that I ain't talked to in years. Hey, man, let's meet at the bar. I'm like, I don't even know you anymore, okay? <laughs> but it's crazy because the road is just paved for me when I want to go. It's, it's past the drink. Past the drink for me on Thursday when I go to the bar. You know, I'm like, when did that start? <laughs> All of a sudden, I'm a pastor, I guess. I don't know, but I'm drinking free. But whenever you're trying to do something good, the devil stops you. A few weeks ago, I had a dream that I couldn't sleep, right? Let me explain. I had to go to church that next morning. Now, I, my whole week is ministry, all week, okay? When I'm at work, I'm ministering. When I'm in the bathroom by myself, I'm talking to God, praying. I'm reading. I'm learning. I'm doing whatever I can to get closer to God, keep my glasses on. Amen. So one night, I could not sleep. It was a Saturday night. I had to get to, to church early because I wanted to be there for prayer. I told Pastor Dave, so I will be there early no matter what, Pastor Dave. I promise you. And I couldn't sleep. I'm up all night, man. 2 o'clock, 3 o'clock, 4 o'clock. I'm like, I got to get up, man. I got to do something. So I grabbed the Bible. I'm like, this will put me to sleep. I'll read numbers or something. Deuteronomy. So I'm like, you know what? Let's go to Thessalonians because I'm feeling some Thessalonians. I open up Thessalonians, start reading it, and I'm looking at it. I'm like, it looks different. I go to 2 Thessalonians, which I'm not very good at, and I realize it looks just like 1 Thessalonians. And I'm like, oh, my God. I don't know 2 Thessalonians, so that's why I can't see it. I must be asleep. I woke up. Okay, I had overslept because in my dream, I thought I was trying to go to sleep. But somehow the devil had distracted me with my own dream. But you know what? God woke me up. I went into the Bible and I realized I don't know it by heart, so I can't read 2 Thessalonians. I must be dreaming. And I woke up, got to church late, but at the same time, I'm like, all right, devil, I see what you're trying to do. But even in my dream, God put the glasses on. He said, grab the Bible, but this is not real. That's what he's saying to y'all. He says, grab the Bible, this ain't real, put the glasses on, okay? Enjoy this life, it won't last forever. Yeah. But ignore those distractions. That being said, y'all, let's go ahead and bow for prayer.